The second part to the products is your reports. This is the second part. It's really important for our manufacturers to gauge how you are performing in easy spec, how your products are performing individually and how you're performing against your competitors. So we'll start with the nomination distribution. Now this is a holistic view of how all your products are performing. So this we will have 30 nominations or 16 percent. Your competitors have 114 or 62 percent. And you've got your generic specifications or the potential at 22 percent. This is a live graph and as we move to the right you'll see your distribution history. So your distribution history is just that we saw on the left hand side as this is a new feature to easy spec this will uh, go up and down over time but it'll give you a nice idea of how you are progressing in this platform. Your monthly views versus nominations. What's nice here is same thing. It's a new feature in easy spec. This will help with that return on investment. So you'll be able to see how your products are faring, how many nominations you're getting to how many views. So how many views is by architects and by specification consultants. So how frequently your products are being seen and then you can. Compare that to how many nominations you're getting. So like anything, the more frequent you get seen in easy spec we should see a trend of your products your product nominations increasing now nominations by item so this is as we go back to the previous tab of your products where they were in there your library was there this is now breaking all those products up with how your engagement how your nominations are going for each one so you can run your cursor over them to get an idea uh, numerically how you're progressing so if we look at the standard grade plasterboard you can see that you've got nine nominations your potentials have six and your competitors have 30. nice way to get an idea of how you're tracking in the market like with all the reports in easy spec you can export these to an excel file you can print them off to a pdf as should you feel the need product usage so product usage, this will give you an idea of and this will inform you of everywhere that you have been nominated on projects. So all your specifications. You can break these up via architect, by state, set update, which is really important. So the set update is when architects first input this information into easy spec. So as your nominations increase, you can get a gauge on the more recent nominations you've had. And if I click on that tab on that space, should I say you can go through and you can put an accurate date on. So if we use for 1st November, OK. That goes through and tells us all those projects from that time. You can go the same with value, construction value, what sector you're getting nominated in. If you want to see all your residential and so forth. And tender date, you can get an idea of when you need to go through and start working your pipeline to make sure that you secure the business at the end of the day. Within these reports, you'll see the architectural firm, you'll see project name, procurement, type of work, construction value, is it a multi-site? your contact, what sector it's in, is it Green Star? Give me a really nice overview on the project, when the tender date is, and then ultimately what product has been nominated below, and the description. So you can go through, make sure that the application is accurate, the information is also spot on. So you can go through and check all that. And lastly, you've got your statistics page. So this will give you an idea. Keep in mind, this is just a test site. But this will give you an idea of all the projects that are specified in EasySpec at the moment. So for this example, we've, you've got 141 projects. You can see how they've been broken up via sector, the construction value, and then you can come across to your nominated in projects, which is now specific to the manufacturer 
how many projects have you been nominated on in those 141. For this example, you've been nominated on 15. Construction value to the right of that. And of those 15 projects, you have 30 products on those 15 projects. Consistent with all our reports, you can export that to a Excel file, so you can put in your own CRM should you choose. You can print that off or put it to a PDF. So that's a very loose outline of how the portal works. Should you have any further questions, don't hesitate to reach out. 